Are you guys obsessed? I used about 10 or 11 new products to create this look. So I'm very excited. Like I had no idea what look I was going to do. When I started looking at the colors, I really wanted to go for like a mermaid, blue, teal, green type of look. And bitch, I think I nailed it. Let's get into the video. Put this all over my lips. Got a matte palette. And I'm going to be using my Cara Galaxy palette to do a first impressions video because, bitch. <laughs> if y'all saw my last video, if y'all saw my beauty haul, then y'all would know that it's about to be lit. So I'm going to start off with my MAC paint pot and I'm going to go ahead and prime my eyelids for eyeshadow. I'm going to take this color. I've been wanting to see um like me do our eyebrow video and everything like that mm. and I will y'all but the thing about that is is like I just feel like there's so many eyebrow tutorials already on YouTube like eyebrow tutorials eyelash tutorials already on YouTube so I really just don't feel like me doing it is going to really help anybody when it's already so many um videos already out there like, I'd rather just film some different content. This blue. And then just blending up so it blends out pretty good. But yeah, I didn't want you guys to think that I was, like, forgetting about what you guys wanted me to film and stuff like that. But I just kind of already am planning out this year. I hope everyone had a good New Year's Eve. I had an amazing New Year's Eve because I spent it with my man. The blending brush from BH Cosmetics. I'm going to take, I'm going to go on with like this a little lower and blend up. Mm -hmm. This brush is very soft. I like, I like, I feel like it's blending pretty well. This BH Cosmetics blending brush was so bomb. It was so soft and it blended everything out perfectly. Like I'm obsessed with blending brushes and this one is so lit. Dark blue right there. And I'm going to blend that in my outer corner. Like I said, I'm going to do this halo eye. Taking the darkest blue, I'm going to go ahead and take that BH blending brush and apply the blue to my inner corner and my outer corner, creating a halo eye. I never do a halo eye, but I just wanted to do something different for today. Each color, and I want to apply that along that, um, along this blue line and blend that out because I don't want that to be harsh like in any way. So I'm just gonna take it and just blend it out. I'm going to take this pigment, which is, it's like this blue and this green like combines into one color. So I'm on my finger and then just apply it to the center of my lid. Oh, that is really pretty. There is a little bit of fallout more into hmm, like more into like this lime green color and apply that on top. Yeah, like that's 
really pretty. For primer, I'm going to be using the Hourglass, yeah, the Hourglass Mineral Veil Primer. I love the way this primer felt on my skin, and I look so funny right now. Like, I look like a little baby Smurf. <laughs> my newest foundation pickup which is the Clinique Beyond Perfecting foundation and concealer. I'm in the color Golden. So right now I'm going to go ahead and take the applicator and start applying the foundation to my face. I hate this applicator. I wish that this foundation came with a pump. I just feel like every foundation should come with a pump. But the foundation blended out beautifully. I'm absolutely obsessed with it. Like it's definitely full coverage, which is what I love, honey. So next step, I'm going to conceal using the new collab. Um, concealer that I picked up. Before I use collab, I'm going to go in with my LA Pro. Um, and this is in the color Warm Honey and put this under my eye before I go in with the collab. I have not used LA Girl Concealer to highlight in so long. Like, I forgot how bomb this shit is. Like, it looks flawless. Just gonna use this one under my eyes a little bit just to brighten it up. First thoughts, it's like super creamy, which is good. It's blending out super easy. And the color's light, but it's actually not that light, probably because I put warm honey down first. to take my airspun powder I'm just gonna set LA girl pro concealer in the color dark cocoa and we're just going to contour those cheeks out honey to a brush from the BH Cosmetics brush kit that I got. And we're just going to blend. Look, I, I, I love this brush. I didn't think that I would like it because it's so small. It moves the product around like you want it to, but because it is smaller, you have more control, you know? Cheekbones. Yes, honey. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, then we're gonna blend out nose contour. Take the BH Cosmetics powder brush that I got, and I'm going to go into my L'Oreal True Match powder, and I'm going to wipe away the bake. Just wipe it away. Away from my under eye. It's wiping away pretty good. I'm gonna go ahead and take some powder and just set my contour. Hmm. I kind of want to 
do something really cute. Um, I have this NYX Vivid Brights Liquid Eyeliner. This is in the color Vivid Envy. Um, I really want to try this. I think I want to line. Yeah, I think I want to line my, my eyelid with this. So bear with me. I have not used this before. Y'all trying to do wing liner. Make sure that you stay in frame and get it on camera. It's so hard. Okay, so I'm gonna let this dry, put on my eyelashes, and I'll be back. Yes, come through, lash, come through, come through, lash, come through. Okay, so since I set my face, I'm gonna go ahead and go on with setting spray once. I like to do this to melt everything together. From my bottom waterline, I'm going to take this NYX. This is in the color Azu. For blush, I'm going to take the Milani Baked Blush. I got the color Berry Amore. And I'm going to use the BH Cosmetics Blush Brush. Mm. I think that's really, really pretty. And the brush, I mean, it's soft. It's moving the product. I think it's, it's, getting, it's getting it done. CoverGirl Total Tees Mascara. And I got this specifically for my bottom lashes, so this little bitch is a hit. The moment we've all been waiting for. I'm gonna take my Artist Couture Times Jackie Ina Le Peach Highlighter. And we're about to go to work, sis. We are, we are about to go to work. And if you're scared of loose pigment highlights, all you have to do is gradually, little by little, just just build it up little by little like oh my oh my god like like it's so beautiful like it is such a beautiful highlight i'm gonna hit that inner corner I'm going to go in with lips, so I'm using the NYX, NYX lip liner in the color Ever. Yeah, Ever is my new fave. Hopefully this isn't too dark, um, but I'm going to take the NYX Slip Tees in the color Beyond Basic. Mm. A little darker than I wanted it to be, but it will work. Yeah, so if you guys like the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I love you guys so much, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.